Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Now today, you guys voted. You really want to see Iago Alcantara, who has just come out as the Champions League player of the tournament card, I guess? Yeah, award winner, Thiago. There's also a Luke de Jong. I had a poll on my TikTok, which by the way, if you don't follow, to participate in these polls, you probably could if you wanted to. No judgment, just saying, suggestion only. But anyways, on that poll, uh, we put it for Luke de Jong or Thiago Alcantara, and most of you want to see Thiago Alcantara. However, there were a lot of votes for Luke de Jong, so I will do everything in my power, considering he's also a La Liga player and I have a La Liga team. I'll do everything in my power to try to get his card, but I gotta do what the poll said, and Thiago Alcantara clearly won by, by not that much, but sort of a big amount. So, he's the obvious winner. I just finished completing his SBC. Here it is, the players I'm submitting. One guy that never played, and if you saw the video on the 92 plus tots, I was really mad at getting him, so I am not mad at all of getting rid of him. I want him gone. He cost me pain, and he deserves it. He made me lose a club legend. Let him go. Smalling, I don't care about you. But Carvajal, though, even though he was a lucky pack that I did, I didn't buy him. He was a lucky pack opening that I got. Everything said, he's still a pretty good player. I still liked him when he played. He's my highest rated right back, but I think I'd rather keep my Ramos player moments just because I think it's a little rarer than this. I, I think that. And Semedo just has 99 pace, and I'm not trading that for him. Um, we've also got Emerson here, Future Stars, and a Perisic, but that doesn't really matter about the rest of them. So, without further ado, let's just submit this. That card looks sick. A 96 Diego Alcantara looks amazing. And he fits my team alright, not the best. Uh, if I had Azuriz, he still would be perfect, but, you know, freaking Chris Smalling came when I had to submit him for the 92, so he's no longer there. But... He still has Ramos for chemistry, the Spanish chem, and look at this card, 96 player, uh, award winner, Thiago, that looks sick. Look at those stats, we're not, we're gonna go better into them right now, but take a quick look at that. That just looks awesome. He's got no stat under 85, which is actually pretty decent 85 to have that, so no stat under that, that's actually pretty good. So. Oh yeah, and we also have that Strakosha there, so we'll just keep that as well. And anyways, let's get into his stats. So, I currently have a team of concept. Uh, as you saw, Carvajal was one of my starters, so kind of sad that we lost him. But now, no, I'm not putting him as a right back, I'm just going to use that as a replacement. Um, Diablo's actually pretty high up in my ranking, even with all these lone players that I have here. So let's put him in there, and let's review his stats, shall we? So, he is 5'9", he's right-footed, 5-star skill moves, 4-star weak foot, that is already pretty sick, I think. Let's get into his attribute details. So, I'm not going to go through all of them exactly, but I'll give you a rundown, 89 pace, 91 shooting, 96 passing, 99 dribbling, 83 defending, and 85 physical. So, he's not going to get pushed off the ball easily with the 85 physical, he is Pretty decent at defending, I guess. Insane dribbling, insane dribbling, insane passing, pretty good shooting, and some pretty decent pace for a midfielder. Now let's look at his traits. His traits, he is injury prone, he dives into tackles, he has the flair, he has an outside foot shot and technical dribble. Besides one of them, which is a bad one, the rest of those are good things to have. Injury prone is not good, but the rest of them are good traits so that is good about that so i'll give you a little moment here once again to pause it if you want to see those stats but anyways guys that is it for today's video i hope you've enjoyed i will be trying to do luke de jong it is in my top interest to do that if it's the last thing i do in fifa 20 it's get luke de jong if i can so i'm going to try my best i have a few gold players still because i did a video where i did open 1581 plus hopefully it's enough to get it I really don't want to sacrifice another player from my squad. I really don't want to have to, considering I am depending on a certain one sub right now that isn't a loan, as I've been my loan, and it's Ramos. That Ramos is pretty rare, so if anything, I'd have to give up to Semedo. 
I really don't want to give that up. I really don't want to. So I'm going to try to find a way out of it. If it's absolutely necessary, I will. I'll try my best to get the young. Uh, I don't want to give up Lautaro Martinez. I, I think I'm really good with him in-game. He's one of my favorite players I've ever used in FIFA. And Benzema is just a very good goal scorer as well. So I don't want to have to give those up. I already gave up Azuriz. People kept telling me, get rid of Azuriz. Okay, even though he's a club legend, I decided to do it. And then I got a surprise that I got Smalling. And I wanted just to erase FIFA 20 right on the spot. But anyways... That's all, so I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, it means so much to me. If you like the background, leave it down below in the comments. I know I already showed it in the last videos, but if you wanna leave a little something, if you want to see something up there, leave it in the comments. I'll try to consider if I can change it up, depending on which video. Sometimes I'll try to switch it around, not always the same thing. Um, that is gonna be seen more once I start doing my reaction videos, which I will start doing here soon so it's not only gonna be fifa but for right now it's only fifa so there's not that much to react to and i'm not fully set up i'm gonna have some lights there as well if you want to see the reaction videos or some fifa or some football soccer videos anything like that i'm also going to try to start a vlog as on thursday of me filming this i don't know when i'm going to upload this but as of thursday i am going to a cabin uh we're gonna go and we're gonna see how good it is. It's in Utah. We're gonna try to enjoy, have some fun. If you guys wanna see a vlog, one per each day or the three days combined, leave it down in the comments, depending on what you guys will say. I'll also post it on my TikTok. So if you wanna follow me there, DD underscore nation, just saying. Also for the polls, all that happens there. Anyways, that's it. Enough talking from me. I hope you guys have a great, wonderful day. I hope you guys have good news. And until next time, peace.